Yes, I, along with my new friend Marcio, delivered a Cessna 206 Amphibian from Fort Lauderdale, FXC, to Manaus, Brazil. This was the trip of a lifetime. So your first question may be, how did I get this call to help deliver a plane to Brazil? My advice to all new pilots is get involved. Make friends and volunteer. Just get involved with organizations that you want to be involved with and you will end up where you want to be, no matter how old you are. When I first got my pilot certificate back in 2017, I knew I wanted to get into mission aviation. So I reached out to a few places and I got involved with a small aviation mission group. I did a lot of video work for them, I did a few flights, hung out with them, then I did their website, then a bunch of media for them. From this, I made a lot of friends. Then one day, a few years later, and just a few weeks ago, I got a call asking if I would be able to help deliver a float plane from Fort Lauderdale to Manaus, Brazil. And that's how it works. It's just that simple. This was the trip of a lifetime. I got about five years experience in four days and everything went pretty much perfectly. The plane was in great shape, very well equipped with a GNC 750, an EDM engine analyzer, the same one I have in my plane, and it even had a new interior. This trip was also methodically planned out in advance. So all the heavy lifting was already done for me. I was very lucky. All I really did was show up. Everything was done in advance. We split the duties and kept them for the entire trip. Marcio flew and I did the nav, radios, and fuel. And it actually worked out perfectly. We got into a great rhythm and we got along so well. A few things did happen. We lost our fuel gauges. We had an odd request to leave the airspace we were in in between Anguilla and Grenada and then we decided to spend the night in Georgetown, Guiana, which is a very, well, very interesting place. Then six and a half hours over the rainforest at 4,500 feet to Manaus, Brazil, and it was four days and 2,200 miles. I have some awesome programs coming up. What you need to know to fly through the Caribbean, dodging weather over the Amazon rainforest, losing your fuel gauges an hour and a half out of Fort Lauderdale, and finding your way through the thickest clouds you have ever seen over the jungle. So stay tuned, it's all coming up over the next few weeks.